So I got this call the other day from a customer who says that their clean out in their front yard was snapped right off clean. When I got there, I thought this would be an easy job, but then it turned out to be a little bit deeper than I thought. So I dug down to where the pipe had actually snapped off, and I put a plug in it to keep all the debris out while I was prepping the pipe. Because the existing pipe underground was covered in dirt, I used Odie's Clear Cleaner to clean off the pipe and get it ready for the primer. A couple wipes with the cleaner, and the dirt falls right off. Now it's time for the purple primer. For some reason, when I opened up this hole, the bees were going crazy. I must have disturbed the ground bee nest. Luckily, I'm not allergic to bees, so I wasn't too nervous about it. Now it's time to set the new PVC pipe. A little primer, a little glue, glue inside the fitting. <sighs> tape measure, who uses a tape measure? Just hold the fitting on the side of the pipe and mark it. It really doesn't have to be that critical. But check out that brand new flex reciprocating saw. Cuts like butter. Pop quiz time, what does PVC stand for? If you guess Pipe Veneers Company, you're absolutely wrong. Because the answer is polyvinyl chloride. To ensure we're not going to get any leaks coming back through this clean-out, we use a little bit of Megalock thread sealant. Now we just put everything back, make it look like we never were here, and boom. Nice job.